Assalamu alaikum, my brothers and sisters. Peace be upon you. Welcome to Minutes to Paradise. In Islam, Iblis is often recognized as the Islamic equivalent of Satan or the devil in Christianity. The term Iblis is of Arabic origin and is utilized in the Quran to denote the rebellious jinn, a supernatural being who refused to bow to Adam during Allah's creation of him. The narrative of Iblis holds significance in Islamic theology and is recounted in various verses of the Quran. According to Islamic doctrine, Allah created Adam, the first human, and commanded both angels and jinn to show respect by bowing to him. While the angels complied with Allah's directive, Iblis, among the jinn, declined. His refusal was rooted in pride and arrogance, deeming himself superior to Adam due to being created from fire, as opposed to Adam, who was created from clay. As a consequence of his disobedience, Iblis was expelled from paradise and became an adversary of humanity. He requested respite until the Day of Judgment, a request granted by Allah. Iblis then pledged to lead humans astray and misguide them from the righteous path. This narrative is often interpreted as a moral lesson, cautioning against the perils of pride, disobedience, and highlighting the enduring spiritual struggle between good and evil in Islam. In Islamic tradition, Iblis is also known as Shaitan, a more general term denoting a devil or any force of evil. The Quran underscores the necessity for humans to be vigilant against the temptations and deceptions of Iblis, emphasizing the importance of seeking protection through prayer and adherence to Allah's will. The concept of Iblis serves as a continual reminder of the spiritual battle that believers face and underscores the significance of humility and submission to Allah.